Hi everyone, Hannah here. Welcome back to the channel. For anyone that's new, welcome. My name is Hannah. I love all things Disney, Lounge, Star Wars, Harry Potter. This video is going to be the gift shop in the Harry Potter studio tour. There's some Hogwarts Express stuff. You can get the train, or you can get a Butterbeer ornament for your tree. I like that. Uh, this one, for example, is £14. Nine and three quarters is £15. Or the Butterbeer is £12.95. Or you can get an ornament of Butterbeer. That one is £12.95. They have this spirit jersey that says Hogwarts is my home and it's got glitter all over it. Leo's just trying to check the sizes for me. It's £60. While he's checking that, they have this lounge fly backpack. Look at this. It's got like snow effect that's embossed on there. The Hogwarts crest with like a, a wreath around it. And the back has got Hogwarts with Hedwig. That says $80 on there. So that's probably come over from the US. So I don't know how much that would be in the UK. But I love that backpack. And then there's this sweater, which is just here. How much are you? That one is £45. There's a Harry Potter bear for £36. And the R top for Ronald Weasley. Oh my goodness, look at that Hogwarts ornament. That's £22. <laughs> hanging cauldron? What's that for? It's to hang your mini cauldron off. Going in the railway shop. Some of the things in this shop you can only get here. I do know that much for sure. That is a beautiful hoodie. How much is that one? Uh, £50. It says it's exclusive to the Studio Tour London as well. Oh, well it says Studio Tour London, so it would be. That makes sense, doesn't it? There is also a t-shirt to match and the t-shirt is £22. That's not a bad price actually. And then there's this red hoodie. Oh, oh with the dragon on the front. Is there a price on that one? Do we have a tag with a price? In this one it is £50 for that one and again exclusive to London. There's, is this like a coin purse? I think it is like a little coin purse for £17. And there's also a mug and drinks bottle with the same design as that hoodie on there. There is a Daniel Nicole backpack, Hogwarts Express. Oh, does that turn? I, mm, it might turn, it might just be a bit stiff in there. How much are you? Okay, the price has been ripped off, so we don't know. Gryffindor t shirt, 28. Nine and three quarters t shirt. This is Hogwarts. Right, that feels like pretty hefty for 19.95 as well. This part says exclusive collection. What is this? Um, it's six pounds. Is it like a notepad? It might be like a notepad. There's this little makeup bag for 20 pound, and there's a backpack. It says for one way travel London to Hogwarts that is the inside she has an inner pocket and for £29 there is like a zip up wallet as well and a tiny t-shirt for the little ones for 15 there's some forbidden forest stuff just here you've got the Patronus there it says the forbidden forest it's £15 there is a card holder What's that? Oh, note cards for £20. That card holder again. Are these pins? Oh, they're charms. So you can get a set of three charms and that one is £15. Oh, and some spider pins. I'm pretty sure these are pyjamas. They look like pyjamas anyway. £22. Is that just for the shorts? That might just be for the shorts. And the t-shirt is £25.95. So we're now in the gift shop, we've just come straight out of the end of the tour. So let's have a look what we've got. £27 for this t-shirt. I will show as much as I can with prices but I'm not going to get in the way of people. A Hogwarts like Turvis tumbler sort of thing for £22. A long sleeve 
shirt for £28. So over this side. Is that a hoodie or a zipper? Oh, oh it's a zipper. Nice, that is. That is £50 if you heard Leo, he likes this one. <laughs> Keep telling him, if he sees it, buy it. There's a cap for how much are you? Is that 15 or 16? I think that's £15 for that cap. What is that? Oh, is that just like those clear paper folders that you can get? How much are you? £7 for those. Oops. Now, we are mid-December. What are we? Is it December like 12th or 13th? Something like that, date-wise. £19.95 for this Hogwarts glass. Another shirt for 29 Oh, what are these? What are you? Sticky notes. Included? No. Oh, sticky notes. Where's the price on this? £12 for that one. That's nice. And a Hogwarts scarf oh, there for £27. There's this notebook. It's clear on the inside. And then this is like proper metal on the outside, the Hogwarts emblem. It is. Ooh. How much are you? You are £19 for that one. There is this beautiful glass for 13 but I'm going to put it down because you break it, you buy it and all that malarkey. Yeah, we'll try and show lots. <gasps> if this was for adults, I would buy this. How much are you? 29 95 for this Hogwarts onesie. That's so nice. I want that for me. They have, oh, we have a lounge fly shoulder bag of the Marauders map. I don't see a tag anywhere on that though. And then there's a backpack. I don't see a tag on the, oh, hold on. I think I saw, here we go. Uh, oh, 50 pound for the lounge fly backpack. There's a Marauders map stationery set. Some Marauders map mugs. Oh, it it's like a heat changing mug. So it changes from hot to cold. That's clever. And this shirt is... Got no price. In the Christmas section, there's the Christmas countdown again. There is this Christmas cup for £20. The Butterbeer Christmas style. These look amazing. Oh, hold on. There's no price on this. I don't want to mess it up. Okay. How much? Oh, gingerbread biscuits baked in the UK. Oh, £25. There you go then. So they were baked in the UK. It almost feels like a shame to eat them. They're so pretty. And this giant like biscuit tin with a golden snitch on the top as well. These ones, it says exclusive, but I know they have some of these in the New York store as well. They are £33 each. They've got all the boxes below. Now they don't have all of them out, so I'm presuming they don't, they just don't have all of them in stock. Uh, this one is the Locket of Slytherin, for example. And then we have Hufflepuff mascot and Cup of Hufflepuff. The bow truckle, oh I like the bow truckle. Hogwarts architecture, that does look like the castle, doesn't it? And which ones do we have here? Oh, I think some of these are the same. There's the Sword of Gryffindor which is not that one, someone else has put a wrong one there. The Ravenclaw mascot. Yeah, they're in different places, because look, that one's not the Locket of Slytherin, but it does look like a snake. So double check the boxes. There's some light up ones there. It says the Magic Caster Ultimate Wand Experience. Ooh. There are some more ones over here as well. I think these are more the character ones. Also, oh, you've got some from Fantastic Beasts, like Newt's Commander. Oh, Nicholas Rommel's ones, that is fancy. And again, they all come in these sort of collectible boxes. Hello. What is it going to focus? It says Draco Malfoy. There's a quill stand and ink set there. There is this cauldron, which looks very similar to the one they use in the afternoon tea for the sugar. $13.95 for that one. That feels very oh, heavy and substantial. There's also that bigger one. Mum's now deciding which one she wants. As we did the afternoon tea here as well, which is in a separate video. 
What's that? Oh, uh, recharging. Oh, it glows. $29.95 for that Deathly Hallows glowing shirt. There is a Deathly Hallows hat for £15. And a button up shirt. Do we have a tag? Yes, we do have a tag. £50 for that button up shirt. There's a couple pins. There is a mug up there that I cannot reach. What's over this side? There's a little bag, like a shoulder bag that's clear, £26. There's another one there, a wristlet for £20. And there's a Deathly Hallows makeup brush set. There's this Deathly Hallows shirt that has sequins on it. You can see on the, both of the arms are full of sequins. It is £47 and it has that sort of bottom on there. Oh! They're reversible sequins, so they're like black on one side and silver on the other. Oh, you can sit there for hours doing that. There's a Slytherin pillow down there. Deathly Hallows earrings. That makeup brush set's tinted green as well. Moore's Morda shirt for £30. Oops, someone dropped something behind us. This one looks more of a kiddie size shirt. Twin, what's that? Twenty-eight pound. Oh, mine not. No, no. It's just a small. There you go. What's this? Oh, it's a little Death Eater. There's this shirt here that's got glitter on the wording. That one is twenty-two pound. This shirt, it's more like fuzzy, not glitter. For twenty-four. That one says this garment may vary in coloration due to its unique nature. Oh, so, okay. so not two will be alike. There's a Niffler as a backpack. Look at this. And he's got his own little bag. How much are you, Niffler? There is no price on the Niffler. So we'll have a guess. We'll say like £25. Scabbers the Rat is £9. Is this Hagrid? Oh my goodness. You can get Hagrid as a doll for £32. Oh. You can get a mandrake. How much is the mandrake? £18. Look at that face. Hello. You can get an owl plush for £15. And there is... Is this like one of the little tooth fairies for £18? Oh, and the, there's a puppet of an owl whose head can turn a full 360. <laughs> Hello, how much are you Mr. Owl or Mrs. Owl? That's where you put your hand up, the owl's bottom. How much are you? £29 for the owl puppet. We have this Niffler shirt for £28. And then there's some more Fantastic Beasts items over here, like mugs and such which like things. How much is this shirt? How much are you? £26 for that one. There's a makeup section. There's this ex exceptional, exceptionally ordinary, that is not going to focus, nail varnish. And there is a Deathly Hallows one. What else do we have? More nail varnish. What's this? Luna Lovegood. What are you? You are £7.99. Oh, it looks like it might be a mirror. If you pop that up. There is a nail file. Ravenclaw. We've got in some, some other house items now. Looks like there's a scarf, hat, gloves, beanie and socks for each house. Beanie is £17, socks £15. I think, oh yeah, they have all the houses. There are the other ones. They have some of those drawstring bags as well. And some notebooks. So just to show the lining on this loungefly bag, can we see what the lining is? It looks like a cream colour. Well, there's a broom there, just generic Christmassy type things. It looked like there was an inner pocket as well. Oh, there we go. You've got the broom, you've got the snitch, you've got a wand, Harry's glasses. So that's the inner lining, and then this is the front of the backpack. I'm very tempted to get that one. If you've seen my videos before, you know I love loungefly. What is this? Oh, is that another bauble potentially with socks in it? Do we have a price? We don't see a price on that one. Oh, actually, in the other shop it said $80 for the lounge fly. Can you turn that round for me? 
$80 again, so don't know how much that would be in British pounds. Scented? Scented? Excuse you? What does it say on the label? You turn it the other way. This one. Pine scented. Pine scented? Right, excuse me, I'm going to sniff it. Oh, it is. Those pine bits right there at the front, they have the faintest, faintest pine smell to them. So, she's a fancy one. More house items. There is a wax seal kit for £15. And they'd have them in different houses as well. There's some Ravenclaw stuff. How much is this notebook? Let's see if I can grab it. It's very heavy. £15 for that one. These look like tiny shirts for kids. £34, yeah, because that's a large, so that's a shirt for the Kidly Winks. Some more notebooks. Oh, that is substantial. That's like metallic on there. That one is £18.95. And there's house pens as well. And that one does not have a price on it. Oh, there we go. Oh no, that's different. So I'm not sure how much the house pens are. But they have them for each house. Let's see if there's a price on the Hufflepuff pin. Oh, there we go. £20. Hufflepuff pulled through for us. And then Gryffindor stuff to match. So they have these for each house. It's just the Hufflepuff side was free at the moment. Different keychains. How much is this one, for example? Uh, £6.95 for the scarf keychain. They have these for every house as well. Some pins. How much are you? £9 for that pin. How much is this pin? We'll have a look at you. That one is £7. And you can get a prefix pin as well. So Slytherins don't have the scarf keychain, but they do have the tie for £9. Oh no, Hufflepuff have a tie as well. So whether they just don't have the Slytherin scarf or they just don't want one. But there are these Slytherin options. So we've come into the section that's a lot of the house clothing. And again, each house does have the same. So £27 for that Gryffindor scarf. There's some gloves and a beanie. The uh, Quidditch t-shirt, £28. They have different sorts of ones as well. That says Keeper on it. That one is also £28. They have the house jackets, zip-up jackets, £39.95. And they have a few different sorts of hats. That one's quite nice. How much are you? £15 for that hat. How much is the Keeper hat? It was also, oh well, that was a weird noise, sorry. £15 for that hat as well. You can personalise a shirt. The short sleeve and long sleeve options. £39.95 Some more house clothing They have these knitted shirts for £75 The robes and you can personalise your robe uh, Do we have a tag? I'm trying to look for a tag that tell me the price Ok, can't see a tag on those so I'll have to check elsewhere There is a scarf I'm so sorry I can't see the price It's too high up if we have a shimmy around, there's the Ravenclaw section. Will there be, oh, this is a tag, there we go. £75 for the robe. Now all the houses will look the same except for the emblem and then the colour that they are. And again, you can get them personalised. Can I see the price on that scarf? Oh, I want to say £28, but I'm not 100% sure. And there is this shirt for £50. They have some Hogwarts lounge fly. This one's £25 and it's, it's, well, it's more just like a card holder sort of option. We have for £10 some coin purses. There you go. They have all the houses except for Hufflepuff in there. That's that same one again. I'm going to try and shimmy around. They have some backpacks. How much? There's no price on that one. Why is there another tag? Okay. Oh, there we go. £50 for these. They are not lounge fly, they're just like generic small backpacks. 
and then there's this shoulder bag style for £40. <coughs> there's a Hogwarts one in like a brown colour and then this one is a lounge fly backpack and it's the Hogwarts castle. Oh, it's stuck in there. Okay, we'll grab this top one to have a look at the back. There we go, that's the back and it has all the houses on there. And then, is this? Oh yeah. So Daniel Nicole for $45. So potentially around £45. And it's like the uniform of that one is Slytherin. Around this side, in the same lounge fly pattern, £60, there is this one, which is a shoulder bag. As you can see the strap just there. Oh, and it comes with this built into the strap. It's like a coin purse. And then the back, whoops, is similar to the backpack where it has, there you go, all the houses. So that's that one. Then this side, there is this, is this a backpack? So it's a small backpack. Um, I can't see the price, maybe about 50-ish pounds. And it kind of, it's got those poppers under there. That is also a Daniel Nicole. They have this Ravenclaw one as well. I don't think I've seen a Hufflepuff one in this style. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, it, was that the first one I looked at? My mind right now. It's all over the place. Oh, there's some down here as well. So look up and look down. And then back to that tiny coin purse. I have some spirit jerseys. It's this one that says Hogwarts is my home and Hogwarts on the back and it's very glittery that is just a t-shirt what's behind it oh it's the Slytherin spirit jersey let's grab this out so green jersey how much are you? 44 95 and that's on the back then we have the Gryffindor jersey and there's this one 44 95 it's got Harry's glasses on the front and it's on the back oh it just says Harry Potter on the back some more Christmas ornaments. There's that Yule Ball one for £12. You can get dresses for £17. Look at these outfits. And you can get Hermione's dress as well for £17. They have some jewellery, like this snitch necklace. It is, it's only £10. That's crazy. And they have the Time Turner necklace. Again, £10. They have some charms as well, so you can get a, where did I say the bracelets? Bracelets up there. And then there's all sorts of different charms, and it says the charms are only £5. That's not ridiculously good. And there's some Time Turner earrings as well. Oh, excuse me, my voice went. And what's down there? Oh, is this a chocolate frog? There's a little chocolate frog pendant. Are you gonna focus? No, nope, it's not gonna focus. It is a chocolate frog necklace though. And that one does not have a price on it, unfortunately. There's a golden snitch necklace for £140. And there's that one for £100. I'm just going to have a quick look at some of these cabinet items. Oh, Harry Potter Alex and Arnie bangles. Oh, there you go, there's some more prices there. A lot of things say either £40 or £45. There's some cabinets over here. Oh, it's a big candle. Oh, wow. Is it? Is that just a candle? It says the Golden Snitch Necklace Collection. Oh, there's a necklace in every candle. That's why it's £65. I was thinking, why would you spend that for a candle? But there's jewellery in there. Oh, Master gave Dobby a sock. Dobby is £90, so Dobby is not free. You can buy Hedwig as well. How much is Hedwig? £80 for Hedwig. You can get the Ravenclaw diadem for 115 The Harry Potter Prophecy Orb for 35 You can get the Golden Egg for 70 Oh, that is fancy. Gringotts Bank Coin Collection for £25. Looks like you get those three coins in there. Tom Riddle's Diary for 30 
can get goblets for each house, they're 39 .99 each. Oh, I don't see a Slytherin one, just a Death Eater one. You can get Hermione's dress. Do we have a tag? Oh, there we go. 69.95 is not a bad price for that, to be fair. They have the wizard's chest set from the Philosopher's Stone. It is £300. But it's very nice. I presume it would come with this chessboard as well. It's very fancy looking. And then some more jewellery. Oh, there's the Horcrux locket. Horcrux locket, rather, for £40. And the ring for £40. Uh, Love Goods necklace for £40. Oh, there's a Hedwig brooch for 75 That's so nice. And a Love Potion pendant for 48 as well. We're in the sweet section. Look at this wall. Chocolate frogs. Oh, this one's a dark chocolate frog. $8.95 each. How could you? Oh, yeah, so it says dark chocolate on the box. And you get a card within each one of them. Fudge flies. Well, they have house chocolate, so Hufflepuff gets orange flavoured milk chocolate with popping candy. Slytherin gets mint flavoured dark chocolate. Ravenclaw get milk chocolate with toffee chunks. Where is. Uh, where's Gryffindor? Oh, here we go. Gryffindor is fudge flavoured milk chocolate have a look they are there is no price on that is there a price on this one okay there's no price on those so i'm not 100 percent sure because there's nothing kind of around here to tell me let's have a look at the peppermint toads are five pound for a box of peppermint toads 30 bucks every flavor beans they mean every flavor how much are you i do not see a price oh 8.95 $8.95 for a box of those. Exploding bonbons, which is orange and pineapple flavoured bonbons for £8. Comes in that box, just there. Some more fudge flies. Fizzing Whizbees, made with chocolatey fizzy fruits. Oh, that one is £8. I like the box on that one. I like the box detail. And then more of the others. There's a ceramic box does not contain frog or card. <coughs> okay, £20 though. Must just be a collectible. Chocolate frog prop replica down there. These ones are just milk chocolate frogs as well. They're still £8.95, same as the dark ones. Oh, this has got a different £15.95, whereas this one's more of a tin compared to just the box so it's more of like a keepsake then we have some butter beer which is butterscotch flavoured sparkling soft drink is there a price no it's no price on that one i'm not 100 percent oh there you go 4.95 that's just me not looking what i'm doing isn't it so they've got the festive one at the bottom and then the non-festive one kind of mixed in you can get some honey dupes merch this looks like the shape of a lounge fly but it is not an actual lounge fly backpack uh, if i just plonk that there for a second i'm trying to see there you go 62 pound for that one is it a placement do they look different oh they do so it's a placement backpack there is this scarf for 30 pound that is very vibrant that's nice and very soft as well oh my god is this a bag 60 pound it is how does this open Okay, my thumb's stuck. I can't fully tell how this opens. Maybe it's magnetic. I've opened something. Oh, oh, look at that. That is fancy. Butterscotch fudge, honeycomb, and then some chocolate ones. So just before we get in the queue, there's some more t-shirts. How much is this one? £22 for that one and some mugs 15 for that one and house cups how much are you? £13 for that one and these they're similar to tote bags they have them for the houses and that is £32 so they have these shirts and hoodies again that were in the one by the train station and it's the one that is exclusive to 
the London, how much is that one? 18 pound. But that one, that is a really nice hoodie, isn't it? And there is a notebook as well. And they also have the blue collection with the water bottle, the cup, the hoodie. Is that a tea towel? I think there's a tea towel as well. And that's by the exit. So those are the gift shops. I didn't manage to show everything. There were some sections that were just really, really busy. And I, I don't like to get in people's way, so I'd rather not show them or wait for a little bit. And then if they clear up, I'll show certain bits and bobs. We did get a few items. I don't know if Leo's already taken the tag off this one. Oh, no, I don't think he has. He got, for £27, the Newt Scamander scarf. He's been after this one for quite a while. And it was the last one there. So much so that I don't think I even saw this one. I'm pretty sure he kind of went and wandered off to search for it. And he's finally got his scarf now. We got some kind of... Is there an official name for these or are they just like placemats? They're £9 each. I got the Slytherin one because I'm in Slytherin. And Leo got the Hufflepuff one. Some nice little placemats there. And they've got kind of like the cork bark on the on the back of them. So that they hopefully won't slip. And then I did also get a spirit jersey. Because I thought it was so beautiful. Uh, it's our price. How much was this one? This one was £60. And it's the blue kind of glittery one. So there's blue and glitter all over the front. With the Hogwarts emblem. And on the back it says Hogwarts is my home. In kind of puffed, puffed out padding, padded print. And Hogwarts is on the bottom as well. Look at that. It's so nice. And it is official Spirit Jersey brand as well. You can always tell because it will have... I'm not showing this very well, am I? You can always tell if it's official Spirit Jersey brand because it will have that Spirit Jersey tag on the bottom. It's normally on the bottom left of things. So that's the items that we got. I do sometimes buy a chocolate frog, but this time I just kind of wasn't really feeling it maybe next time though but thank you all so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye